All right, guys, so we're here at my new home. Now I'm just gonna give you a tour of it. It's kind of front porch. Excuse the uh, adult beverages. It's got a little nice yard to it. Got a pretty good backyard as well. It's kind of what I went with. I've been, um, I wanted a yard that looked good. I was very picky. That's why I looked for three years. So, front porch is pretty nice. I mean, it's got a swing on it. I'm a sucker for front porches and it's got a back porch as well. Coming in, this is the living room area. Sorry, it's kind of dark. There we go. Um, this will be like the couches and everything that are gonna go. Uh, front TV, front TV, living room TV. Hopefully I can get all 65 inch up there. I don't think I can. I think I can only fit like a 58 inch up there. Uh, it's gonna be kind of awkward getting one out of the kitchen. I don't really cook that much, so there's some paint. We painted it, so it was like a bright yellow. It's kind of ugly to me. I didn't really like it, so we painted it. Uh, it's supposed to be a gray. It looks looks pretty good. I didn't think I was gonna like it when it was drying, but it looks a lot better now. But hardwood floors all the way through into the master bedroom, except for the guest bedrooms. They have new carpet in them, but kind of. Got a decent size guest bedroom. The second guest bedroom is the biggest. I mean, I guess if you stand out here, you get kind of, this camera is a wide view, so it's gonna make it look a lot bigger than it is. But we go around here. This is the other guest bedroom. Somebody left change on the floor. What's <laughs> up? So, but guest bedroom is pretty decent size. I'm gonna have a buddy that's gonna move in with me possibly just to, for a place to stay. Let me pick up these quarters. Um, and then this is probably gonna be like, he's either gonna move into this room or, and this is gonna be the enter entertainment kind of room, like game room, or this is gonna be the entertainment room, and that's gonna be his room. Don't really know yet. Just a bunch of different closets. Guy left me a vacuum from 1950, but it's much appreciated. The guest bathroom, which is much bigger than the master bathroom. What's up? Kind of awkward thing about this uh, house is uh, the laundry rooms right here. It's kind of kills my OCD, but it works. So I gotta buy a washer and dryer. That's the only thing utility-wise that I have to buy for this house. He left everything else. Um, another little closet for towels and stuff like that so this is where it's hard to paint it to this wall right here everything down this is the master bath the uh, master bedroom also kind of funky but i like it <laughs> it's just kind of elongated and not like this way long it's more this way long uh, tv from 1960s just kidding it's not it is an old tv though uh corner view so it's a pretty nice bedroom. Uh, the walk-in closet, uh, pretty pretty nice size walk-in closet, and the master bathroom, which is decent. It's decent size for me, being the only person here. Uh, a lot of changes coming to this for my first home. Uh, got a lot of plans for it. I'm just here picking up some stuff, so I'm gonna cut all these lights off. So it's gonna get dark for a second. Um, for this being my first home, it's it's nice. Um, God, I know you can't see anything. God, my dad closed this door. It's so weird being at home alone. But I got a really good steal on this. Uh, if you don't know, if you're not trying to buy a house right now, or if you're trying to sell your house, you probably know that the housing market is ridiculous right now. Um, I closed the other day, and the closer said this was the first house First three bedroom, two bath house that he sold under 130,000 this year. So I'm not gonna say exactly how much I got it for, but I got it for a whole lot lower than that. So the guy was just trying to get rid of it. And um, he got, he found, he didn't even get put on the market yet. My realtor knew him. He knew that I worked as a firefighter. He just wanted to help me out. Sold it to me for a really good deal. And he owns the other side of the property. Um, so it's like, let me see if I can pull this up and show you. So he owns over there little shop and everything he just does a shop on his off days but he said he's not really doing it anymore so 
he said that he'll probably sell me this that side of the property in like a year or two so i mean it's gonna be a good investment because i mean who knows where i'll be in a year or two i guess i could buy that and make it even bigger property and sell it for even more than i got it for but the backyard oh yeah i forgot about that <laughs> excuse me so this is the deck you just put on not that big of a deck but it is a deck i guess brand new ac unit this property goes back at least maybe 50 50 feet back so i'm gonna try to clear this wood line up slowly at a time back and then just put sod down uh, i'll get it cooler man it's hot outside if you don't the south man the weather is ridiculous during the summer humidity is crazy but yeah that's pretty much the, the house tour um i'm comfortable with showing you guys that um I, I, I mean, I want, I use YouTube as a, a place to look back on when I'm older and be like, hey, that was pretty cool. That's when I first bought my house. That's what it looked like. Things just to look back on. I mean, if I meet some of you guys in the process, that's even better. But I got really lucky with this. I mean, it came with all utilities uh, except for the washer and dryer, which is, I can find one of those on Facebook. Um, so I didn't realize how much, how hard it is to get everything you need for a new house. Like changing the locks out or small stuff like a freaking bathroom plunger i don't know it's just so many different things you have to rebuy so it's definitely different but i'm going to head to home depot we're going to pick up a couple of things with a buddy of mine and then we're going to come back here and try to install it i got to take this lawnmower and gas can to my parents house because they need it because um, i do not have a lawnmower i bought a push mower but they use a lawnmower but there's a hill so they need the push mower for that so they're going to use it as well i'll let them borrow that and plus this leaves it for a place to leave it over there because they don't live too far but sorry i keep moving this camera not in the right place um so i will see you guys later if i video record after this it'll probably be here installing some stuff so yep i will see you guys then all right guys so i'm back from home depot and we got a couple things I'll show you right now. I'm just putting up these uh, little path walkway little uh, lights. They're solar panels. Put this thing up, little door, front light, front porch light. It was pretty ugly. It was this one. <laughs> that one. Ah, it was so ugly. Bird poop on it. Anyway, I got some roundup stuff. I'm going to spray the weeds out out there and a little bit on the garden right here a little plant garden uh, it, excuse me this house is a mess right now even though there's nothing in it there's a bunch of trash from stuff putting in change the doorknobs i can't remember if i showed what those look like but change them out with this it's like bronze bronze um door and uh deadbolt so that looks really good got a bunch of other things that i gotta put in uh let's see what else did i do I did the door on this side. God, I feel like I've done a lot, but I had it. Did the door on this side as well. Oh, I need a lot. So, I'm about to paint this back door because it's kind of, I don't really like that color. But, shuts, stays locked. It's just a door with new hardware. Uh, I'm trying to think, what else did I do? Still got a bunch of other stuff to do. I got, I bought a new faucet. Spent a good bit of money at Home Depot. It's always fun. God, it's hard to do with one hand. So we got this. It's the same color as that doorknob, just for the bathroom, master bathroom. Toilet paper holder and this little um, towel holder. So like that right there. So it's the same color as the doorknobs. I kind of like that bronze color. Right now, it's I don't know what color it is. God, it's a weird band house still by myself. <laughs> Uh, I'm a child. Anyway, so it's gonna go right there. There is none right there. So I bought this a long time ago. And I put it in when I first came in here because it was like first thing to do is do that. We bought these old vanities, uh, toppers, what do you call them, soap dispenser, and toothbrush holder and stuff like that. And this towel. This thing's got to come down though. I, I mean, I like it, but it's just I might get a um. 
I'm gonna put on get like a medicine cabinet kind of thing and go like right here. God, it's weird. I see myself in the mirror. Anyway, still no Wi-Fi out here, so I haven't moved in completely yet. God, that looks so crooked. Anyway, it's the guest bathroom, so I don't care. Put a, oh, I put a new uh, smoke detector. I got to paint around it because it was the the other one was older or bigger, so the paint didn't get all the way around the new one. So I got to paint that. I gotta clean up now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to kind of do like a little time lapse of me putting the uh, pathway walkers in. So let's get to it. All right, so we got it done. It's the final product. I'm gonna have to see how well they light up because when I had them, when I put them together, the solar panel was covered, so it was shining. They weren't that bright. So hopefully, they are bright. If not, I'll just go buy some new ones, and that'll be it. Next plan is to like fill this with more mulch. I gotta spray it down with some Roundup as well on this side and out there because it is nasty out there with weeds. So. That's the next thing. Let's get started on that. All right, so we finished that. Took about two passes of it. Almost used the the whole like gallon jug. So hopefully that works for all the weeds over there and all that kind of stuff because it doesn't look very nice over there right now. But that's part of being a homeowner is making sure the house looks the way you want it to. So I think that's pretty much it. I'm, I'm gonna chill for a minute on this little swing and uh think about things to do next I got work tomorrow which means I'll be gone for 48 hours the internet people should be here pretty probably tomorrow or the next day and then uh, that's about it really I'm gonna try to keep you guys on this journey with me so you guys can follow along with me oh, this this uh what do you call it this uh, handle this rod is not very it kind of, kind of leans forward and leans back, but this is the side of the house. Right. I had to cut the grass the other day. Luckily, I had some buddies with me and they cut it. They helped cut it. Um, got a pretty good side yard. Yeah, back yard is pretty good. It's just kind of close, but it can be pushed back. It goes all the way back to that fence line back there. So, the deck. Some dog, there's some dogs back there. I don't know what they're doing. Oh, look at that. I forget. I ain't seen one of these in forever. Look that moth. I forget what they call them. But yeah, if you see that fence way back there, I'll see if you can see it. Yeah, that's how far the property goes back to. And I don't know if I mentioned this earlier today, but that side over there, it, um, it's got a two-door shop on it and a little pavilion and a, shop and a shipping container. And he's going to sell me that side in about a year or two. If I still want it. Um, God, those dogs are loud. Uh, but yeah, so keep walking. I know this is kind of boring, but I'm trying to show you guys around the house. A 360 walk around. I need to put that, um, put the thing back up. Let me, let me hook it up real quick. Okay. Wish I, I really want to put that underground. All of these, he's, he's got, he doesn't have them underground. I'll take that satellite dish out because I'm not going to have satellite TV. I don't want it. Just scream it. It's 2021 now. Little dirt spot right there. I'm going to fertilize that. Man, is that wet right there? Like, 
Oh, that's not soak up there. No flooding problem. <laughs> but now we're back around. I have to do something right here. A little garden right there. Plants right there too. Look at that. Flooded right there a little bit too. I really want to put some of that like um, the checkered, the same thing that was on the back deck uh, around right there just so it, I mean, it looks a little bit better maybe. I, don't, I can't really think about how that's going to look so I don't know if this one would be good or not. So that would be another plan. But yeah. That's it pretty much for now for today and today's little vlog. I plan on doing these every now and then when I start moving in and changing stuff. I have a lot of plans. A lot of plans especially for my age. There is a dog here. So I made some new friends. Those dogs are pretty chill. They're behind me somewhere over there. In the neighbor's yard. Terrorizing the neighbors. I gave him some water. I didn't have any dog food. I would have gave him some of that. But threw, threw some sticks. It's chilled. It's two random dogs. But they came pulling up barking. <laughs> they were not friendly, but they, they, were, they were real friendly. But I'm going to end the video here for today's episode. Uh, next one should be moving in and stuff like that. So the next video you should see I'm either moved in or I'm not. If I'm not, then it's something else I'm doing. Uh, I plan on moving in in the next week or so. So don't know how many times I've said that. But anyway, I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I will see you guys next time. See ya.